The real issue, though, and we've been talking about vehicles, is there are just too many cars. For example, if everybody in the world lived and drove the way Australians do today, uh, global greenhouse emissions would be 172 billion tons of carbon dioxide equivalent per year, which is something like five times more than total world emissions today at a time when we need to reduce emissions by about 80% by 2050 in order to avoid the worst risks of climate change. If everybody drove like Australians do today, uh, you'd have over five billion private vehicles on the roads and they would take up an area larger than the country of Austria just in parking spaces without any of the roads to get the cars out of that lot. So uh, this is not gonna happen. We're going to need more light rail, more trams, more buses, more, more inner city trains uh, in order to address the problem of mass mobility in a world of 9.3 billion people by 2050.